Well, the CDC has reissued an order to stop the eviction of millions of Americans behind on rent. The new 60 day eviction ban is for areas with high and substantial spread of COVID-19. So that does include most of our area. But there are steps that you have to take to get this protection. In WCNC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson joins us from uptown with those details. There's a lot of uncertainty right now. Some say it's a big relief and the moratorium should protect renters, but there are steps that renters need to take to stay in their homes. While renters struggle to maintain a roof over their head and landlords try to keep their businesses afloat, a last minute extension of the CDC moratorium banning evictions for COVID struck communities. I was thrilled that we get two more months albeit somewhat un, somewhat unsettled at not knowing exactly how it's going to work. Housing attorney for legal aid of NC Thomas Holderness says the order has created some confusion for renters who have been on the verge of eviction, but staying protected remains the same. Eligible tenants must sign a declaration showing they can't pay rent and have tried to get financial assistance. Holderness calling the order a temporary fix that may not hold up in court. But there'll still be cases that'll go forward other than for non-payment or if the tenants don't submit the CDC declaration or the landlords could still challenge CDC declarations. And so there's still going to be action in the courthouse, just not the deluge that we expect once the moratorium really ends. The CDC action aims to keep people in their homes to avoid overcrowding and homeless shelters. Mecklenburg and other counties experiencing high or substantial spread of COVID fueled by the Delta variant. The moratorium giving states more time to get out nearly $47 billion worth of rental assistance. Still, many fear for the wave of evictions ahead. So people that get displaced, it's going to be hard to find a new place just because of the limited supply, as well as now they've got an eviction on their record, and so that makes it harder. So, you know, I don't know how that problem is going to be solved once the inevitable comes. The new order expires October 3rd. If you need help, Ramp CLT is offering assistance. Reporting in Uptown for WCNC Charlotte, I'm Lexi Wilson.